Hey guys, Cameron here, chilling in the sweet loft. So today, instead of looking at another piece of technology, I thought we'd check out something amazing in nature, like my pet gecko, Apollo. He climbs on just about anything, but his feet don't have any talons, claws, or hooks. He doesn't even leave a slime trail. To be honest, I have no idea how he's even staying to that wall. Time to get some help from National Geographic Kids. Nat Geo Kids Expert Vending Machine. Hmm, more expensive than I remember. Hey, Camry. Hey. I'm David Gruber. How can I help today? How do geckos climb everything on just their plain feet? Every gecko's foot has a secret. If you look closely, their feet aren't so plain. Let's check out my high-resolution photos of gecko feet. Whoa, these are cool. I love collecting photos of geckos. They are amazing. Thanks. Anyway, each toe of a gecko foot is packed with millions of tiny hair-like structures called setae. These hairs allow them to cling to almost any surface. I've got a ton of hair, but I don't cling to anything. That's because your hair isn't the same as a gecko's. Sete are way thinner, one-tenth the size of a human hair, and they're specifically designed to stick to surfaces. Maybe we should get a closer look on Apollo's feet. Great idea. Whoa, Apollo Sete have a life of their own. I wish my hair waved like that. Don't we all? There's a reason for this movement. Whenever Apollo takes a step, the sete flatten to make close contact with the surface. To create a larger area of contact with the wall? Exactly. Now check out the tips of the hairs. On the tip of each hair are hundreds of split ends. Ugh, I hate split ends. Yeah, but geckos love them. The split ends fan out to grip the surface. The grip of a single strand isn't strong, but all of them together can keep Apollo clinging wherever he wants to go. Where's he going, anyway? I think under the radiator. We should get out of here. Cool, let's go. Now that you know how that works, catch up on all the other episodes of How Things Work by clicking right here. And also make sure you subscribe to Nacho Kids by clicking down here. See you next time. Bye.